What's happening folks and welcome to another episode of the Tottenham Hotspur Let's Play episode 2 If you're excited for this episode hit the like button down below and subscribe to the channel to keep up to date with all the content on the here Down below is my Let's Play channel as well, go to that out as well, got uh, lots of other non-football manager related content on there So today guys we're on the page of Hakan Chan Loglu, it's only because I don't want to show anything else to accidentally reveal anything that's happened, the deal's been done uh, it was all, I think I mentioned last episode. I talked about the deal in, in detail. So if you want to see if you want to see details on that, click on that um, first episode, second episode. Sorry, it's so, so three episode three. It's not episode three, isn't it? I forget because first episode kind of blurs into the first in, in, in the in first episode, and second episode kind of blur into one a little bit. So we've got two games of camera to go through, and we've got an early goal of season contender. Let's see. Let's see if you, if you can spot it. So yeah, a very good start to the campaign. Three wins out of three so far. Obviously, Leeds United just saw that last episode. Um, not Everton we played well, um, but so the day it was. A, it could have been any. It could have been any score, and, and it could be. It could have been a win for us like it was. They could have won, and it could be a draw, and any result would have been valid in my opinion. And the first game three 0 What a goal from Kulusevski, and that was a pretty straightforward three points. Three pointer there. Champions League has been drawn, and we have got Bayern Munich, Sporting Lisbon. And Rangers, so it's not an easy group with Bayern Munich being in there, but you'd fancy to get at least a second spot in that group. You'd think, um, obviously, depends how, how we perform in those games. So next episode, um, we're, it's we kind of have to do um, Bayern Munich and Man together, but we've also got Liverpool there as well, who could be a potential. It's a big game, so. We're going to Liverpool and Spanish but next, and Bayern Munich and Man United together. I don't see the reason why not. My series, my rules. Um, so yeah, so we're going to do that. Those two games there. Champions League is in, is important. Then also those two games back to back against Bayern Munich and Man United, and then we've got one, two, three, four, five, five uh, games, and then we'll probably do Chelsea and Man City together, and then we'll see where we're at in Champions League group after those four games. Because after that, it could be a pointless match. So to show the more major games here. And then round about there, we'll get the mid-season mid -season summary kind of thing. So let's get into action, shall we, guys? The first in the first game. Now, we are on key highlights. Because I did play that key highlights. I did, I did play key highlights with the games off camera. So this is working so far. Uh, but this is a very tough game away at Arsenal. Uh, I don't expect this to be an easy game whatsoever. But we've won the games we... When I saw the fixtures, I saw Arsenal and then Man United, Man City quite quite soon. I thought get those first three wins early on, just to you know get the wins that you don't. You can't expect to win the Premier League, of course, but the games that you think you know what we should be eyeing, we should be eyeing three points in them. So and we've done that. So we've got to maintain our level now. Uh, this is not going to be when their form is not great. However, it's early season, so form is not really relative. If they play, I, I, I answer their fixtures, but they, if they played City. And Liverpool in the first two games and lost them too. That's not exactly a bad defeat, is it? That makes sense. As you can see, uh, Man United bottom of the tape, bottom three, of course. That, this, this is not very early days. We're in a title challenge at the moment. <laughs> it's not, I, I can't see that happening. So let's go back to the extended highlights. Um, and yeah, let's go. Let's see if we can beat Arsenal today at the Emirates. Got a throw in here. Poro, Wob Prowse. 
Poro, can he find a cross? Oh, it's just a ba bad pass or bad play from Mentenko. What what Prowse? Hoiberg, Poro, can he find a cross? Or uh, he's tried to put it in the penalty area. Jorginho loses the ball to Bob Prowse into the box. Bob Prowse. Now Kurosevsky! Oh, I don't know what happened there. I think he missed it. He does. Ben Deco wins, the, wins it back. Now Son. Tessignon. Harry Kane dropping deep with that passing ability he has as well. I went back to to Son. Son's got too many and he's going to do very really, really well to get anything out there. Well done. Tessignon backing him up. Son, the penalty. Nice little take. He's throwing goals. Son! He's got to go to this far post there. He really does. I think he just got crowded out a bit. Sinchenko throws it in. Jesus flicks it on. Now Martinelli. In the penalty. Ah, that's stupid. I don't understand why that's a thing. Foot manager. Why players keep doing that. Um, what is it? What's that in their, in their um, list of abilities? Makes them do that. It's just ridiculous. He's not going anywhere, and this is again a soft penalty we're giving away. Um, I say it again, I think we did. Did he leave? Should he slips up? Saved by Lorries. Clear it. That's fine, says Jungian. We got away with it there. Uh, but why? What is it that makes players do that on this game? Like, what is a stat that makes them more prone to do do that? Like just diving in there for no reason, other than obviously the pay trade that says that. And Arsenal got a bit of, win, bit of, a, bit of a, a second win from that now. Says Jungian. Gets across there, cleared. Benton Court, he's been a bit... Attack us a goal. Yeah, um, Benton Court twice now. And that's a pathetic goal to concede. So, um, Benton Court there, I'm going to berate him. I just feel like he just was too lazy. Uh, and again, ball across the six-yard box and no one works it out. Just, okay, the winner's penalty here, no one picks him up, look. Ball gets cleared, we don't... Benton, is it Benton Court there? Son, sorry. And then the ball comes in here and just... What are you doing there, Poro? You've got to see the... He's the only guy you can... You've got to run back in position and mark him up. And it's not a goal. But then that's when Cummins is that penalty. Arsenal seems to, to, to have got going now. Longley. Kusevsky. Longley. Romero. Benton Co. Been a bit of a poet off the, off the ball work rate today so far. Good ball to Kusevsky on the right-hand side. And he found the pass. He's found Poe. Early ball. And it goes towards Son. And it's cleared. Reaction, Benton Co. Benton Co's work rate today has been really, really suspect. Kuzeski, he's got a chance ball box to Harry Kane. I thought he was on side. The instinct was he was, but I've got a sneaky suspicion that he might not be. Um, are they going to give the goal or not? I've, he is, he is on side. This was, this was, this has got to be very close. This has to be close. Let's have a look. That looks offside to me. As the ball comes in, but again, will we get a replay with the with the lines? Yeah, I want to see this again. Well, look at Kulaksevsky as the guy. I think it's Kane we need, we need to see the lines for. Jinko throws it in. Cleared. Son. Again, just simple. Just not trying hard enough off the ball. It's not a good move that they just need to just work hard and chase things. We're a, bit, we're a bit off the pace today with our work rate. Get at him, Quan Kane. Just try. Yeah, you see they're not, they're not running off the ball. They're, 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 they're reactive rather than proactive. Saka is in the right hand side. Get in the, don't, don't, be, oh, just too easy. Lads, come on, demand more. You've got to work harder. They just, they just seem to be a bit too passive. When there's a movement from an Arsenal player, we are not preempting it. We're just, yeah, again, desire from Arsenal is much more than us today. We're just not competing enough in the 50-50s. But half-time, 1-1, one, one, we'll take it. But they're not, the they're off-the-ball work rate ain't good enough. Not acceptable. Um, they, they're keeping the ball quite well. But when I've when seen the 50 balls and movement and I'm not, I'm not seeing a reaction. I've seen that again. Benton caused an absolute shocker today. Is it, it's an absolute shocker. His passing's been woeful. Again, you see the root. see again. It's Benton, is it Benton Coe again? Or is it Kane? Benton Coe again. Again. I may take him off in a minute because his work of the balls is woeful. 
Kwasewski, Mentencourt, Walprouse, Hoiberg, Romero, Bentoncourt, Hoiberg, Porro, try beat your man. He, no, he, of course, wasn't on, lad. There was no... He, he didn't shift the ball. Lombard Ramsdale. Jump. Second ball. There you go. Get rid of, get rid of it, Ward Get rid of it. You're under pressure. I hate when they stand on the ball. Under pressure, they, they stand there with the ball. Get rid of the ball. He had time to put up a, a first-time pass there. But again, it's the work rate from Arsenal better than ours. This is the goal. Because it's a mistake. Has to be a goal, doesn't it? Clear it. Yeah, the, 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 the sharpness and the energy. Again, sloppy play. Just come on, let's pick the pace up a little bit. Be a bit more... Again! Stop hanging on to the ball, Ward Prowse! And he's been sent off now. All comes... Here we go, yeah. All comes from a lazy, sluggish, slow play. Been like that all game. Been like that all game. A lot of them have been doing it. Just been absolutely woeful in our possession. We've been woeful in our ability to actually try and win the ball back. And we want, we want too much time on the ball as well. We've got to stop doing that. When we're under pressure, get rid of it. But Arsenal have been a better team. It's been a better team, Arsenal. We are going to be looking to get anything out of this game. This is the goal at five post, isn't it? Ooh. Yeah, just for minute one, it looked like a team that was just going for the motions of today. I'll take a draw right now, but I don't see us getting it where this game's gone. It's a single. I've got more direct to try and stop him holding the ball too much when we need to get the ball forward. Because that's going to punch area. Back to him again. And again, you see the fight is not there. I don't care about that's not that, that is not down to quality of that bit of movement, that bit, that, that bit there. Ages is through. That was not down to quality. It's just desire. There's just no desire from them today. They just seem to be not up for it today. And that is one thing I will not accept. For my team, he's not been up for a, not been up for a match. They are just second to every 50 ball. They they in the in the fight in the battle for in, in can't talk in the fighting for the ball. They're just giving up. I'll take a draw right now. Give me a draw. I'm going to start wasting time in a minute. But yeah, we're just not at it at all. Clear the ball. Clear the ball. Clear the ball. Why are you taking touches there? Just get the ball and work it away. Taking too many touches. But here we go. Corner kick. You know what, lads? Just focus. Get the draw, and Gavi. You get. I'm not having this work rate in this team going forward. We're going to actually kick it out of them. Saliba. I'm just not seeing it. Pentecost is not trying there. He's just standing next to him. Again, just the second fifth. Oh, for God's sake. They just right. We're wasting time. We've got to waste time. The only way we're winning this game is wasting if we're wasting time going short passes and slow race and slower and slower tempo. Uh, we're not winning this game. We're not getting anything out of it. Let's go with game, please. Balanced. Um, I'm gonna make changes as well. Lucas Moore's come on for Kulusevski. Take off Poro and bring Emerson Royal on. Just for fresh legs, really. Um, get Akan on. He's not ideal, but he's just. Benton Coe has just not done it today. He's the Benton Coe has been one player doing it, but they've all been at it today. Lonley, Basuma, Lucas Mora, Emerson Raul. You got the yeah, fuck me. The passing is absolutely woeful. Get in front of him. Pathetic. It's not even a good goal from Arsenal again. It's literally desire, not working hard enough to stop the ball. But we give the ball to Paul it, and then they just count us. Look at this. I mean, why are you so narrow there? The, the danger's here, and he gets in front of him. But look at the guys running in. He runs in with desire, and look at Longley, walking back like he's got all time in the world, and he didn't get back quick enough. But we deserve to lose this game. We're the second-best team, but it's been the work rate and the desire off the ball not been there. And for minute one, it's been like that. Well, we can't complain about the result, but the desire off the ball has been shocking. Arsenal wanted it more for minute one. They've got full time. Two, Arsenal two, Tottenham one. But they've not had to work hard for it. We've just given it to them. We just we from minute one. You know what? Furious. You're not good enough. Uh, from minute one, there was there, there was warning signs. When the ball was in 50, 50 areas, we just let them have the ball. But anyway, it's still in a good position in the league. We we have to be up league spot, but we we need to we need to get that kick that out of them. We're quite not good enough. Anyway. Brentford at home next. We've got to bounce back. Right, folks. Manchester number two against Brentford. 
and we're fifth at the table, which is probably where we should be, um, based on the expectation at least. Expectation at least. But yeah, it's got a bit better. Oh, luckily, we've got Akan Chonogu back. Uh, I say back, he's he's starting to take his world prowess as a complete idiot. But yeah, I just want to know what it is about players' stats that makes them diving for penalties like they did against Arsenal and diving from behind against... Um, and diving by like like what Prowse did. I just don't understand why it it what is the issue? What what caused them to do that? But the only thing to look at it is we didn't, we, we lost our first test. The only thing is to the only thing to look at it is is that we're the first team we should maybe lose against. We have lost against um, and only by now over one by one goal, and we won over three matches. So hopefully we can bounce back today at home against Brentford. But we got a bit better than we did the last time. The one thing I will say about FM this year, I've not, and it's now three saves, three saves now I've had this happen. If your team is not working hard off the ball and winning the 50-50s, you ain't winning the match. That's what it looks like to me. If, you, if, you, if you're winning 50-50s and looking like live off the ball, you win the matches. If you're not, then you, go, you, 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 you don't always lose, but you, you struggle. Brentford at home, here we go. We keep, we keep throwing for Brentford and we're already looking like we're not great enough. However, once it forward... Again, 50-50 ball. Yeah, you see not winning them. Porro, Hoiberg, Benton Court, Son, look up. Slog it. That's poor pass, that. That's a poor pass. Any kind of defender who lurks that gets that. Benton Court, Kane, Benton Court, Tessignon. Good ball to Son. Hold it up. Wait for support. Or don't. Or give, just, just, give, just give it away. Long ball. Okay. Got time, long lay. Don't take too much time, though. Play it forward. There you go. There you go. I can. Better. Poro on the right hand side. Can he find a cross? Or oh, pass. He's found high control of glue. Back out to Hoiberg. It's a long shot. Never on. Don't know why he's shooting from there. It wasn't on. Okay, I can to take. Curls it in. Cleared. Reaction. There you go. That's what I want to see. I can. Romero. Benton Co. Get out of here. To Arrow. I can. Well done. Good, good work, great. Son. Get in the box. Hoiberg hits the shot. And there you see. Ah, Kane there's got. I know he's not got pace, but he's got to try and get there quicker than that. He's got to move. As soon as the ball gets hit, he should be following it in. He wasn't following it in, was he? He was just kind of waiting to see who went rocket net. One five plus. Kuzevsky, 1 0. It's been coming. Um, we've been the more likely side in this game. I mean, the keeper may have been better there. The keeper's right at the near post. I think he could. He's probably, he should probably be saving that. Um, let's look at it again. Obviously, good point for sitting on this. And then Kulosevsky. It just looks like the key we should save it, shouldn't it? Uh, but we we'll, don't we'll care. Okay. It's 1-0. Like a second goal, because we've been... It's, this feels like a game United, got, United game against Brentford early just, last night for me, when United seemed to be on top at the first time. Got the one goal and didn't get, didn't get a second. Again, go get him. It's like there's passing... Oh, God, here we go. This feels like a goal, doesn't it? Just they, they they just seem to be so passive. Again, win that ball, Kuzeski. Well done. That's it. Run now. No support. You got to run with it, mate. All right, and he gets past the guy. He's got a pass on there. Yeah, it just feels like off the ball. We just don't work hard enough yet. But in the game, we need to work at work on that. But second half, uh, Doug and Pearson out there. I just feel like off the ball. We just uh, the last couple of games today and today. In, and Arsenal, we're just not getting tight to people. That's a poor pass. Son. Oh, gone. Get it to Kane. Again, see the pass, doesn't play it. Again, why are we so flipping deep? Um, just move a little bit more. I just don't like how we're not trying to press the ball. We're trying to just sit back. We're not a counter attacking team. Yeah, it's coming, the goal. We've got to... Yeah, it's coming. That's the warning. Pick it up, lads. Kane's been quiet this game. Tessignon. Too narrow. Get it wide. Get it wide. Get it wide. Again. Get it wide. Penalty. Yeah. 
It looked like Son got there first. Please give us the penalty. I think he gets there first and get, nicks it away. Penalty awarded. Big moment. There's this is game over. If Kane puts him back in the net, this is game over. Pick a corner and hit it hard. Don't try and play it. Hit it hard into the corners. Brilliant for Harry Kane. Tottenham 2, Brentford 0. And now I make changes to this game. Right, get Kane off us. Let's make changes so we don't get players injured really at this point. Um, Dan Juba can come on. Basuma can come on as well. Uh, Skip can come on. Poro can come off. Just get basically first legs off the pitch. Oh, that's not I can make. Fair enough. Lost count. Yeah. Uh, not a good performance, but it's important not to lose, not to lose two games in a row. Or, 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 or fail to win two games. Or fail to win two games in a row. Good players with Mary Kane. Right into the corner. We have the we have the two goal lead. Surely now three points in the uh, yes, make changes, please. Surely now game over. Well, surely not a third goal from this range. No, I thought not. It's where it, it at the start of the season. If he said to me that he have his first four games to get three wins out of four, I would have taken it with the defeat being against Arsenal and a snatch your hand off. Um, just don't like the work rate off the ball that I'm still seeing as being a problem. I don't know if it's a if it's managing issue where players don't work out off the ball enough randomly, or if it's more likely to be a problem with this team. But as things stand, we are two points clear of fifth already after four, four games played. However, the fixture list coming up is not kind. We've got Liverpool next, which should have, which should have basically um, a nailed on defeat into it in this game this year. Next year, they should get, I want, I want, next year in Liverpool, I want to see a massive downgrade because they've been absolutely woeful this year. If United had that, if United have players have that kind of season, they get downgraded massively. So I want to see the do save for Liverpool. It happened before when United, by the way, in case you're wondering. Um, so, uh, next episode, we're, well, Liverpool against Sporting, is what I said we'd do. And we're going to do that. Um, because obviously, I don't like doing, in case you're wondering, guys, new channel, I don't like doing, for example, this. So basically, Liverpool and Wolves. I don't like game gaps between matches. I don't like it. It just, just what's my flow. I prefer to back-to-back -back games. So, We'll do Liverpool and Sporting next. Then we'll do Bayern Munich and Man United. And then after that, we'll see. It's probably going to be City, Chelsea and Chelsea and City after that. Um, depending on Champions League groups, obviously. But I think four games there. Rangers back to the things I'm looking. We've got to beat. We've got to beat Sporting and we've got to beat Rangers. Those are the three games we've got to win. If we win those three games, we'll be fine. I fancy Rangers and Sporting to take points with each other, maybe. But anyway. If you have enjoyed the episode, I hope you have. Hit the like button down below. Subscribe if you're new as well. I'll catch you all next episode. Don't forget to check out the Let's Play channel down below. I'll catch you all next time. Bye-bye.